for your interest in Fresh KDS. Your first steps to using KDS will be to register on our Fresh Tools website. After that, all you need to do is download the Fresh KDS application for either the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store. After downloading and installing the application and opening it, you should see the following screen. Please use your username and password that you use to register with your Fresh Tools account or any user that you have since created that has rights to add a device. After entering your username and password, simply click tap the login button. At this point, the system will return any brand that you are a member of in the event that you are a member of multiple brands. After tapping the brand that you're interested in using, you will see a list of locations. These locations will show any location that has KDS as an active tool. After tapping the location of the you'd like to use, you will then begin be taken to the main KDS screen. At this point, please set up the KDS as a printer inside your Square Register or your Square POS. If you would like to make changes to the configuration of KDS, please tap the hamburger menu and then tap Settings. Inside the Settings screen, you'll find various configuration options to help custom tailor KDS to your needs. You'll be able to change the device's name, you'll be able to see your current version, your current IP address of the KDS device, and also the ability to make changes such as to the caution and late times, which control the color that your tickets will turn as they reach certain time thresholds, the font size, and combining orders. We currently allow you to turn the combining orders on or off that will combine any ticket with the same name within five minutes. Over here to your right, you'll see various add-ons that we have. Currently, we do have an integration with Tugo Technologies, which is an online ordering platform. If you have a Tugo Technologies account, you're able to activate that here, and any Tugo Technology order will directly show in the KDS order screen. You're also able to change your colors, which are going to effect to quickly identify the type of order that you are seeing. As you can see here, for here has a green color, to go has a yellow color, delivery has a purple color. If you wish to change these colors, all you simply have to do is tap on the bolt, which will open up your color palette, and then simply tap the color that you'd like to change it to. After your configurations are complete, please go back to the KDS home screen. From here, you will then begin to see your orders. If you will give me one moment, I will send an order to the KDS screen. As you can see here, the order has been received by the KDS as it was submitted by the Square POS. One note, you are able to individually tap an item within the order and it will then be checked off. This is to help if you have multiple people working a station and you need to know what order items have been completed. Once you're ready to clear the order, simply tap the order header and then it is sent to our systems for storage and metrics. If at any time you have a need to recall an order, simply tap the recall button, tap the order you wish to see, you'll see the details of your order and then you're able to recall it. As you can see, the order is then recalled and placed in the front of the queue. Also at the same time, you're then able to individually tap items again and then you're able to dismiss once more. I hope this gives you a brief overview of the possibilities of KDS and if you, please, if you have any questions or concerns, please don't hesitate to reach out to Fresh Technologies.